Are you a big fan of Screencastify? Have you been using it lately? Did you see that there's some new updates to it? Normally new updates might scare you and make you think, oh no, what have they changed? But I promise that this is for the better. We see over here on the right that we have sort of the classic looking Screencastify menu once you've recorded a video. So you can see I recorded a video called sharing uh, permissions on a Google Doc. And now I have some new sharing options. One of the ones I have that's classic is always copy the share link, which if you cop click on it, automatically changes your settings and puts it so that you can paste that URL into an email or a classroom link or whatever, and everybody has access to see it. You can see more sharing options and how it gets set if you click that little menu but there's some new ones here that I think people are really going to enjoy one of the ones in the middle here is that you can now generate QR codes automatically that'll go straight to your videos you can download the picture to use in some documentation or in Google Docs or whatever you need or you can actually just copy the image and paste it into something you also have a share to Google classroom link and when you click this it might ask you to uh, sign in the classroom if you haven't but you can choose any classes you'd like to then send your video to. You have a couple other sharing options you can explore, but one of the nice things they've added is this new viewers feature. You be able to, you'll be able to see now who and how many people have seen your video. So I happen to know that nobody's watched my video yet, but that's okay, I probably haven't sent it out yet. There's also some other new features like interactive questions, exporting videos or anything like that, but we just wanted to make you aware that Screencastify is constantly working to update their product and has come out with some really nice things. If you have any questions about this service or any of our video recording services, reach out to Pat and Kate in the tech department.